Welcome to the Sakonic L758DR Quick Start video series. In the five videos that follow, we'll help you set up your meter, guide you through the basics of light metering, and even show you a few advanced tricks. Let's get started. In this first video, we'll show you how to get your L758DR up and running and give you a brief overview of its most popular functions. First, let's install the battery. Simply unclasp the hinge at the bottom of the unit and insert the battery. The 758DR takes CR123A batteries, which you can find in most camera or electronics shops. Power on your meter by pressing and holding the power button. The unit is now ready to operate, but before we start metering, let's take a brief tour of some of the most popular buttons and icons. These four graphical icons at the upper left of the LCD represent your measuring modes. The sun icon is for ambient light, meaning any form of non-strobe light. And the lightning bolt icons represent three different options for strobe light metering. We'll tell you more about these later. The T icon is for shutter speed. T stands for timed shutter mode. The F is for F-stop. You navigate among these icons by holding down the mode button and rotating the jog wheel. After you release the mode button, the jog wheel will cycle you through the specific setting. In the upper right hand corner, you'll see the ISO setting. This can be adjusted by holding down the ISO 1 button and rotating the jog wheel. The lumosphere can be raised or lowered by turning this dial. And the L758DR can be used for spot or incident metering by rotating the dial on the viewfinder. Again, we'll discuss all these in further detail later. This concludes our quick overview of setting up and operating the L758DR. To try some test metering, continue on to the next video in this series, Metering Ambient Light.